well, can you roll a Razorback mower? Well, turns out you can. It takes a lot though, pretty much. I've never had a problem on uh, off-road, anything like that. A few times I've gone off on an angle and you just put your foot down, because it's so low to the ground, you just put your foot down and uh, it comes back down. It's, and it's usually you're on something, not, not that you've just tipped over, you're actually on, on a log or on an embankment that's at, on that angle. And finally, you know, finally it feels like, because you've gone so that far, it feels like it's gonna tip, but it never does. I've had it on over 45 degrees and it didn't tip. This is a different story though. Just gotta walk down here. Probably cut that all out. Anyway, here she is. Now, hopefully I can, I might have to pull it over with a pull drive. What's that wire there? So looking at it anyway, it hasn't got the roll cage on it. You can buy a roll cage for them, a bar that goes over the back seat. But it's landed on the frame of the motor. The petrol caps come off. Or I forgot to put it back on. That could be an issue. Um, otherwise it looks fine. I've just got to get, on, get it on its proper side, which I think I'm going to have to do with the four-wheel drive. Now what happened was, I come along here too fast. And I was a bit closer to that fence than I should be and went over this clump of grass and the, the wire sticks out here the wheel the, the uh you know these big knobbies grabbed at the wire made the, the steering turn into that fence and then it climbed up the fence and it was all right for me it just once it got to a certain angle i just uh put my foot down on the ground because it's so low to gravity it's so easy to just step off and then out of the way so it was not you know it's rolled but there was no problem no problem whatsoever for me um i found it just yeah just step off there's barely even a step there you just um it's almost like it just happens naturally so there you go you can roll them <laughs> let's get it back up so i was able to roll that back over by myself no you didn't didn't need the four-wheel drive just got under it and lifted it went over easy nothing wrong with it um this come out, that's just my lead for the winch. Put that back in there. The fuel filler gap, gauge, uh, cap, I just filled it up and I didn't put it on, so that, that didn't that it didn't come off. That didn't come off, it just uh, was off, that's all. <laughs> didn't lose too much fuel by the look of it. That's about what I was at. Um, it's landed on this. No problem whatsoever. Doesn't look bent in any way. That's the bend that was already at. All right. Okay, I'm Star, Star Off Grid. Hope you enjoyed that. See you later.